Hey guys, I thought today I would share with you a new brush I got for the boys. Uh, hopefully it will help brush their beards out better. It is by Wet Brush. You guys are probably familiar with that. I use one on my own hair because I have uh, really fine, thin hair. So I saw this at PetSmart. I think it was either $8.99 or $9.99 and thought I'd try it out. I'm washing their faces today because it's 4th of July. Happy 4th of July, by the way. And I was going to take a 4th of July photo. So I thought I'd videotape and share this with you guys and see how it works. Now, you probably could buy a mini wet brush, <laughs> but I'm a sucker for designs on things. So it's got little... Uh, Paw prints and hearts and stuff on it. And this is shaped a little bit different than the mini travel ones. The mini travel ones are real round and this is more like an oval. So let's see how this goes through their beards. Magnum is hiding under the bed by the way. <laughs> he does not probably want his beard brushed. So I'm going to start with Mozzie. Mozzie, oh Magnum are you going to join us? Do you want to join us Magnum? Come on. Oh. <laughs> he goes. Okay, so I guess I'll start with Miggy. Oh, yeah. Miggy hates his beard brushed. He always has ever since he was a puppy. <laughs> oh, this goes through nice, you guys. Ma our, uh, Max and Mozzie have the... <laughs> really, Miggy? I brush your beard all the time, and you're really still going to act like this. <laughs> he hates his beard brushed. I don't know why. Okay, let's try Marley. Sorry if you guys can't really see this with all these dogs up here. But Max and Mozzie have the, Max has like really almost like a fine hair like mine. So I'll be interested when I get to Max. Oh yes, this doesn't pull, it just slides right through the beard. This is nice. This is nice, you should, oh. You should like getting your beard brushed now. Yes. Okay, come here, Max. Oh, come here, Max. Here, here, Magnum. You stay right there. I'm going to do Max. Okay, I guess you're next. Oh, yes. That's nice. Someone had mentioned in uh, the comments, I think, on one of my videos, I think it was one where I was um, showing how I freshen up their beards. I can't remember, but somebody mentioned using a wet brush. This is nice, and if you got, uh, if you keep your schnauzers um, longer, like on the legs and a skirt, this would work really nice. Yes, I like this. Do you like it, Magna? Do you like your beard getting brushed? Okay, come here, Max. Okay, Max, you're the real test. I'm gonna stand up, you guys. Because Magnum doesn't seem to want to give anybody any space. Come here. Yeah, this is working really good on Max's beard. Yes. You guys should like this better. It won't pull on your beard so much. Yeah. Okay, Maz, or Mazzy, did I do you? I can't remember. I can't remember. I don't think I did. Yeah, I just washed their beards today so I can take their photo. Pretty, pretty babies. Yes, and I bought these. Um, these are actually bibs for babies, <laughs> and they're reversible. Fourth of July, they were on sale for, I think they were two ninety nine at Meyer. So I thought I'd do a couple of of them in the photo with the stars, and then one with the stripes here on the side, which actually has stars on them too and take our photos. I might even take a photo with them. I've got my 4th of July shirt on too. So let's see how they look. Let's show them. And you know what? These baby bibs fit perfect. Look at that. They fit perfect on you boys. Here, Magnum will do the stripes. Magnum, will, I always have Magnum sit in the middle on photos. And then we'll do a star on Max. Come here, Mozzie. Come here. Come here, Marty. Come here, Marty. Come here. 
Good boy. Yeah, so now I just have to dry their beards and get them looking nice and take their photos. I don't know where I'm going to take them. Probably just in the house. It's really hot out today. I don't think we're cooking out or anything today. Yes, this brush is great, guys. If I can find a link for it, I was looking on Amazon for it and I couldn't find it, so I could link it below, but I'll um, try to find the, uh, see if it's on PetSmart and I'll link it below for you guys if you want to try this brush out. This works great on the beards, and like I said, it'll work great on their um, skirts and legs too if you keep them longer. Awesome brush. Thought I'd show you guys them with their bandanas on. All the neighbors are having cookouts. Yes! Mickey's other, Mickey's other balls in the uh, house. Because it was going to rain. I didn't want it to get rained on. Let's go see what these guys are doing. <laughs> oh, I smell everybody cooking out and I'm starving. Hey! No one's over there. No one's over there. They're gone. I forgot to bring your other ball out. Yes, I did. Okay, guys, I'm gonna. I just want to show you with their cute bandana. I took their photos. It's gonna be the thumbnail for this video. What are you eating? What are you eating? Come here. What did you eat? Did you eat a pear? Oh, yeah. So I took their photo, and for Fourth of July, and I'm gonna go in here in a minute and share my expenses and my um, emergency fund. What we're up to. So. I just want to show you how cute they look. Yes, I'm starving. Everyone's cooking out and I can smell it. Oh, I'm hungry. Okay, guys. Today I also wanted to share, along with this um, wet brush I got, I wanted to share our expenses for the month of June and where, or, excuse me, where we're at for our emergency fund. Sorry, I can't talk. I'm starving. I can't talk. <laughs> um, so for our expenses... Uh, Chewy.com, we spent $127. That was for dog food, canned cat food, and dental treats. Um, vet bills this month, or this past month, June, uh, came to $226.73. And if you remember, I had to take Kitten to the vet because he wasn't feeling well. Um, so, oh, let's see here. What did this break down to be? Oh, this is for the heart guard. Um, I had, so while we were there with Kit and I also got some Aquaquil for Miggy. He's the only one taking it right now. Um, fingers crossed that Marley and Max won't need it anymore. Um, so his Aquaquil came to $63.65. And then Kitten's exam and the medication he needed came to $93.16. Um, and then we had to get some heart guard for July and Kitten's Revolution for his heartworm and flea and tick. And that all came to $62.79. So like I said, vet bills were $226.73. And then bully sticks, um, we spent a total of $80.91. I had bought B Miggy a new basketball at the beginning of the month, which cost $9.99. I bought a new dog bed, which came to $29.99. So that brought our expenses to $447.89 for June. And then for our emergency fund, okay, our emergency fund. Here's what it's up to. I'm so excited, you guys. <laughs> this is such a peace of mind, having this grow. Um, uh, here we go. Here's what we added to it. Sorry for the shadow, guys. Um, Patreon, $116.95. AdSense, $184. So that's the ads that play in my YouTube videos. So thank you guys so much for letting those play. That's the most I've ever made in a month um, on my AdSense. And then my Amazon store, you guys shopping through my Amazon store, made me $38.88. So we added $339.83 to our emergency fund. So thank you guys so much for supporting our channel. Um, all these papers here, <laughs> I forgot these were hanging here. Um, this is to remind me of some, or 
not Max. Magnum needs his rabies shot and his new license. And then this little postcard is reminding me that Max and Magnum need some vaccinations. So, okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope uh, you guys try out this wet brush for uh, dogs because it works wonderful. Look, yeah, I thought you hate your beard brushed. You want, your, you want me to brush it now? This makes it so much easier to brush through the beard, so I know it will help on long-haired uh, uh, schnau uh, schnauzers that have long hair on their legs and <laughs> on their skirts if you keep them long. What? You want this brush? You want this brush? You want me to brush ya? You want me to brush ya? No? <laughs> so try this out, guys. We'll see you in the next video. Hope everyone had a great fourth. Bye.